What's up guys? So just a quick little video. I was roaming through one of the local junkyards today and I asked if they had any wheels and uh, they told me they didn't really have anything. They showed me a pile of wheels. I asked if they had anything nice. They said no. And then I spotted some of these wheels in the pile of junk wheels. So this is what I saw. And when I saw them, they were actually like this, with the face down, like that. But I saw the bolts coming through the back, and I was like, hmm, what are those? Turn them over, and they are these Workmeister reps, or replica wheels. So I know already, everybody can hear in the comments, ah, oh, those are fake wheels, those are replicas, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, they're fake wheels. They're not real workmeisters, and obviously, if they were, that would have been an incredible find. Um, but nonetheless, I asked the guy out of curiosity how much I could get them for, and he said twenty-five dollars a wheel. And I was like, "Take my money." <laughs> so I've always loved the. I think they're SR threes or something like that. They're the three-piece um, workmeisters that work makes. So I've always liked those. I always think they look awesome on the FD and I've always wanted to set an 18 but knew they're insanely expensive and used they're still right around a thousand to fifteen hundred dollars for a set. So found these, got them for a hundred dollars and obviously they're in pretty rough shape. They're fake as hell and the cool thing about them is that they still look fucking fantastic. Um, so let me just show you these up close, some of the damage that are on them. Um, so obviously you've got all this delamination around all these fake ass bolts. Um, see the bolts aren't even really metal. The bolts are actually fucking plastic, chrome plated plastic or something like that. So, you know, uh, obviously not the best quality and, uh, some of the faces have some pretty gnarly like rash on them. So. You know, not in the greatest condition, but at $25 a wheel, I still think it's a fucking steal. Um, the brand, as far as the branding goes, there's no markings on them other than this sticker that says they were quality tested. So, you know, they're obviously top quality because the sticker says so, made in Thailand. And I guess that's a little better than China. And then <clears throat> they've got some of the information on them. It says LTA 286 some of the there they are via rated i don't know if that's fake or real could be fake who knows um and then it says that they are 18 these ones are the 18 by 8 um that's where the stamp is on these i measured them they are 18 by 8 um and i believe they are 5 by 1 14.3 um with an offset of et 20. so <clears throat> pretty aggressive offset not like insane um i think they're all et20 i'm gonna actually double check that right now et20 on that one so check this last one here et20 as well so they're all et20 so now i need to decide what i'm gonna do with these wheels um obviously i don't want to rock them like this and honestly, I'm kind of up in the air whether or not I want to rock them or not. Also, they all have these AW center caps. I have no idea what brand wheels these are. No freaking idea. I actually searched on the internet for AW wheels, uh, Workmeister knockoffs, blah, blah, blah. Could not find these wheels anywhere. So I have no idea who makes them. Um, but one of the things I want to do is refinish them. So what I'm going to do is pull out all of these shitty fake bolts buy a set of bolts i'm gonna i'm gonna go cheap as hell on this i'm gonna get some bolts some real ones and i know that's dumb because the bolts don't actually go to anything uh they just go through the you know there's not actually on these fake or, or they call them faux piece wheels there's literally it's all one piece i mean they're still just as strong as a normal one piece wheel um but the bolts literally just go through the back to nothing that's 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 really all there is to them um, but they do look pretty decent on the car so curb rash yada 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 these things need to be cleaned up and redone I'm gonna buy some wheels I'm gonna get the cheapest fucking wheels I can I think they're m7s um, I'm gonna polish this all this uh, peeling out of the 
add a little laminate out of here and I'm gonna fill some of these gouges maybe with some JB Weld and sand it flat and refinish the wheels in the cheapest way possible and either I'm gonna sell them and I mean if I spend a hundred dollars to to make these look brand new at the end of the day I'll be two hundred dollars into them and there's no way I'm gonna get any less than that by selling them so I'm hoping that they'll look decent enough that I'm willing to rock them in the car and you know I think they're gonna look pretty good so those are the wheels I'm gonna refinish them up paint them up and hopefully they come out great and if they come out to my standards uh, they'll be going on the FD and I'll be getting rid of the CR Kai's I know taking off real works to put on fake works doesn't really make a lot of sense but um, I think I'll be happy with these if the offset works and everything fits just fine. If not, you know, I'll sell them, make a little bit of money, and put that money towards getting a real set of uh, either, I'm looking at the CR2Ps or CR2P works, which I really like, or some actual workmeisters. So we'll see where all this goes. Anyways, just want to do a quick little video and update on these wheels I found. And of course, I'll take a video of the process once I get the bolts and the stuff to refinish them. So stay tuned. Um, I'm not a wheel guy by any means. I've owned a lot of real wheels. I've owned a lot of fake wheels. And I, the whole wheel, real versus fake debate, I'm not really about that. And I don't really want to get into my opinion on that. Um, these are VIA rated. They actually have a higher rating than my works the CR Kai's, so I'm not worried about it. I think that these ones will hold up just fine. And, um, you know, opinions. Anyways, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Wheel content. Wheelie good content. Anyways, like, subscribe. Uh, thumbs up, thumbs down. Leave a comment and share with your friends. Peace.